today we're starting out right here in front of my hometown archery shop, Performance Archery. This is run by Jeff Friedman. A lot of you people are going to remember that name because you see Jeff every year down at Summit Archery setting up me and Bob Matthews bows. Well last year at this time we were with him when he was setting up my new Matthews Chill. This here is the Chill R. They just come out with the Chill X. Matthews is about to run out of alphabets for the Chill. Hello Jeff. How you doing buddy? All right man. Well if you remember last year we was here at your shop or your shop down at Summit yep. and set, we were setting up the Chill. It was an awesome bow. Then a few months into that, lo and behold, they come up with the Chill R. Now, what was the main differences from the Chill to the Chill R? Well, they shortened the brace height a little bit on the Chill R, but they also added nine feet a second. This bow shoots 342 feet a second. Awesome hunting bow. You just happen to have the newest and latest greatest from Matthews here. We do. We got the Chill X and we got the Chill SDX for the women. The nice thing about this Chill R, the Chill the Chill X and the Chill SDX is they got that new rock mod for the Chill X. That mod is interchangeable on all four bows. It, you can do a 75% module, you can do an 85% module. Those guys that want to shoot the 3D and they want to get a little bit more speed, they put that 75% on, they can shoot their back tension, the shot goes off nice and crisp. They want to use it for hunting, they switch it to an 85% mod, they're holding less weight. Still, great shooting bow. As you see, we got that Chill X in. 35 inch axle to axle. They designed this for the 3D guy and the bow hunting guy. The guy that wants to do both with the same bow. You know, I, we talked about the rock mods. We can do an 85% mod for the hunting guy. Got a nice, great let off. You know, at 70 pounds, you're holding 10 pounds. Wow. I mean, you can hold that all day long. For that guy that wants to shoot 3D, we put 75% mods on. He's shooting his back tension release. A little more holding weight. Shot goes off real easy. They also incorporated this grommet down here so that that guy that wants to put that back stabilizer on that 3D bow, he can now. That's going to be real important to the 3D guys to be able to add that for their target shooting exactly. and, and take it off fast for hunting. Yep. And you know, it's nice because I actually use the front bar and the back bar when I hunt. I use a little shorter stabilizer, but you know, my bow sits still, doesn't move a bit. They also come out with that women's SDX bow. There's your alphabet again. Yeah. Nice thing about this bow, 330 feet a second, 29 inches, or 28 and a half inches, 60 pounds. 330 feet a second. Well, there you go, women. ladies. There's no excuse anymore. You all can be shooting a fast bow, too. You know, the women that don't want the pink, that's okay, because they come out with neutral colors for this bow also. Jeff, I keep saying every year, what is Matthews going to do next? I'm dumbfounded. I have no clue, but they keep getting better and better and better and better every year. 